This program is used for creating, exploring, and analyzing a wide range of mathematics. Students can construct interactive mathematical models ranging from basic studies about shapes and numbers to more advanced illustrations of complex systems such as graphing and calculating equations. Students are capable of using tools to help model, calculate, graph, and more on this program. Students can select the arrow tool to point out, rotate, dilate, or translate de desired objects. This is useful to edit a shape clearly and precisely. The point tool is used to plot points on a graph or add points to a shape or figure. The compass tool can be used to create a perfect circle with any size radius. The straight edge tool can be used to make any line segment, vector, or perfectly straight horizontal or vertical lines which do not have to have any endpoints. The text tool is used to insert any size of text matter which can be useful to label points or figures. If we press the compass tool, we will be able to create a circle of any size and take measurements. After making the circle, click on the arrow tool to highlight the circle and then click the measure tab and measure the properties desired. As being shown, we can find the circumference, the area, and radius. In order to distinguish different circles, we can change the color of the circle by highlighting the shape with the arrow tool, then proceed to click on the display tab, go down to color, and choose your preferred shade. You can also make the measurements vary by increasing or decreasing the radius, and it will automatically update the properties. We can use the point tool to place different points amongst the circle created. After points have been placed, you can then measure the angle by doing this. By clicking the graph tab, then grid form, and clicking square grid, a graph will appear. Students can then plot points anywhere on the grid. Once the points are plotted, we can find the distance between the two points. We can also find coordinates We can connect two points to make a segment. We can construct parallel. or perpendicular lines. We can also translate reflect rotate or dilate the points. This program allows us to create line segments on the grid. Having done so, we can find the midpoint 
of each line segment. We can also find the length of a line. Angle between two intersecting lines. Coordinates of ed endpoints. And also the slope of the line. Geometer Sketchpad can be used effectively in a classroom in more ways than what we have shown. It can be used to replace pencil and paper for graphing. Students can perform tasks neatly and easily. It is good for students who do not have great fine motor skills because it replaces having to do tediously graph points and so forth. We would use this program in our classroom for in-class assignments and homework. Then again, we would only use this program once we know our students have acquired complete knowledge of the tasks at hand. The relative advantage is that it creates an easier way to grab objects and it is good for students who are incapable of doing the work manually. Geometer Sketchpad is a good problem solver for this because it offers students a chance to express their knowledge of graphing pencil-free.